This vlog is going to be also massively jam-packed. I am selling my car. Oh, but I do look a bit red because I, I have been a bit angry. I have got the new car. I am absolutely in love. Stress level skate. Three. Yeah. Mistakes have been made. Right everyone, it is Monday. Do I need to start a new vlog? Yeah. Oh, I do, don't I? Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Mark back running the video. Hope you are all well. This vlog is going to be also massively jam-packed. It is Monday the 31st of July. So we're about to go into August, about to go into the holiday month. But today, I am selling my car to get a new car. So I'm really excited. We went through yesterday, I didn't film any of it. Um, I just sort of, to be honest, it'd been, it's been quite hectic. It's been quick, I think that's why it feels hectic. But it is always good that it's so quick because we are actually picking up the new car today and we got everything accepted yesterday. So literally within 24 hours of getting to the where we went, 24 hours later, I'm literally gonna be, have, I'll be in the car. So it has been really quick and the type of car and everything that I wanted was so fast, but I will probably get into that later um, because I don't want to give away what car I'm getting until I get it and I can film it and all that good stuff. But I am really excited. I am sad to see my first car go, um, but I will get into that right now why I'm sort of getting rid of it. One, I've been thinking about it for a long time anyways because I do think I am just paying that little bit too much for what I actually use a car for. I was paying, I'll be transparent, for the actual car itself. I was paying £346 a month for it. It is a really nice car. It has so many cool features that, and like a few features that I will miss in this car. The automatic handbrake, like yesterday when I test drove the other car, I did drive off with the handbrake still on because my car, the handbrake just automatically goes off when you put the, like when you get your bite. Um, so I will miss that. Um, I did just like how my car looked as well, but ultimately for £346 or whatever it was, um, to, was yeah, no, I know that's what I said, just for the car, um, it, 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 like, with everything included, including insurance and that, it was north of £400, so it's like, I just wanted to save a bit more, and I am saving about £100 now, um, and in my opinion, I'm getting a better looking car, a more fun car. That is like the most important thing. It's like, I love like, I, like when I was a kid, this was the type of car that I remember watching a Tinchy Strider music video and he had one in. Um, and I really wanted one from then. And then I sort of grew up and I became tall and I was like, it's sort of maybe he's given it away a little bit, but I was like, oh, I'll never be able to get one, but I test drove it yesterday, felt really comfortable, and yeah, I'm just, I can't wait to pick it up, but ultimately, the car that I had was just too expensive for literally like a five minute, if that journey to work, Some, and then like going to the gym, and then doing like a food shop and stuff like that. And then also, Katie's getting a, a new car, um, which is obviously her car that she's got, is, like a, is yours classed as a mini SUV? Yeah. And then is your new one as well? Yeah. So we're gonna have like a big car anyways for, if we do have kids down the line, like we have got a car for kids or if we need to give multiple people in the car, we can take that one as well. So there's a, a lot of room. So yeah, it's all, it's all happening. I'm so excited now I've started the vlog, but we're gonna go outside, we're gonna clean my car up and then we're gonna head off to sell the car um, it is in part exchange, so we are sort of going to Newcastle to sell the car and then going to Teesside, I believe it is, to pick up my new car. So yeah, it is um, going to be a long old day, but yesterday, man, if you could have seen us, we went from Durham to Newcastle to Teesside. And obviously we left the lodge yesterday at 11 and it was just like non-stop. Um, I want to say a massive thanks to Jess and Luke. They came and helped us out massively with getting the car sorted, getting this, the car sold and stuff like that. So yeah, massive thanks to them. But yeah, I've been waffling on for four minutes now. We're gonna go and clean the car and then I'm gonna have my last drive in that car to sell it before going on to get the new car. Right, and that is all the key rings off the main key and we've got the spare key ready to go. 
Katie is just wiping down the dashboard and stuff, I think. There she is, in the car. Did feel a little bit sad walking out with the car keys, with the V5 and all that stuff. But yeah, I am like excited, nervous. It's like all, all these emotions right now. Um, I'm just gonna turn the telly off because we will be leaving soon. Also in the last vlog, I don't actually think I showed you the finished outside of the little project that we were doing. Dude. So that looks a lot nicer. Uh, the grass will need another cut soon. That patch there is growing through massively on that side. So yeah, we will get that all cut before Thursday, get nice and freshly trimmed. But I'm gonna put you down because the camera is on like two bars. There will be a lot of talking today, a lot going on today. A lot going on this week. Like it's, it's such a crazy few weeks we're in for. Like it's, feels like a little stressful, but if I can't lie, but like exciting stress as well. Like it's all exciting things like the holiday, new car, potentially moving house, selling this house, like, oh yeah, it feels mad. But my dream scenario is that we're on holiday and someone puts an offer in on this house. That is like the dream scenario. So that is what I'm trying to manifest. But yeah, I'm gonna pop you down. I hope you are all well. Remember to subscribe to the channel as well. Um, I do keep forgetting to say that, um, I'm told you should say that, so yeah, remember to subscribe if you're not already, like the video, and yeah, follow our journey. Everyone, we're at the dealership, got all the documents needed, we are about to say goodbye to the car. This is it. Katie's, few, Katie's saying she's upset, but she absolutely hates this car. It's still, it's the fact that it's your first car, it's and still... It is upsetting, but catches when it's... Right, everyone, the car is all dropped off. Was a bit of a pullover. I do look a bit red because I, I have been a bit angry. Basically, what happened was the price we got quoted has dropped significantly. We were quoted 19 eight, nine. 19 nine and they were coming back saying 19. 19. Although so he did actually, the, the person at It was going to be 18, 18 and a half. Five. So it was going to be like nearly a grand and a half and the guy on the phone was like, oh, I'm not going back to them saying, oh, it's a grand and a half lower. Which is like, I, there's no, there isn't major damage on yeah, the car. Yeah, there isn't. Either, the, so the, like, the car's literally a year and a half old. It's, it's like, not even. not even that. So it's like, there's, it, there's a couple two, of little scuffs two, and scratches, two scratches came in. There's two scratches yeah. that I saw. Um, he, he basically said it's within the dip. We did think something was off when we were getting the car priced because, I mean, some dealerships were offering like 17 and a half. I think maybe it's even lower. So we were a little bit like, there's something seems up, but you're obviously always going to go for the, the best, best one. So we went there and then we've sort of haggled it up to get the finance settled, which was 94. Sorry about that. Um, so we we basically we're not paying any more. We're, than, not, getting, like we're, we're not, not getting. We're not money. getting anything, not getting but we're also then not paying because if it was just nineteen, we would have had to pay four hundred yeah. quid. So I was happy with that, and it's still like it still is a good deal because it's still better than everything, everything else. But we're getting everything else was like, oh, you're gonna have to basically pay more. Yeah. Well, you're gonna have to. Uh, Some of them. Oh my god, this is fine. Oh, oh god. Oh, no, god. Liam, help. Where Liam. is this? Oh, I, I must be out now. Out. Oh. So yeah, um, we've got that. Sorry. We've got it all paid off. Yeah, sorry about that. We've got the settlement done. We're now just waiting for the car. It's been cleaned. He said it needs some petrol in, MOT. and then it just needs its MOT. So but he's gonna call, call when the MOT is going in. Is going in because it's about a 45 to yeah. an hour drive, anyways. And then we're all done. We've paid the deposit now. All paid and yeah. yeah i just just walking around well, now, mate, we're we? gonna go to the new barker and stone house just outside of metro so i will catch us in there for a little bit of potentially new home inspiration
everyone, it is Tuesday. Um, I went to show you, I got some clips of the car last night. I've not showed you them yet because it was absolutely chucking it down. So I didn't have a lot of great footage and the camera died. That was the main one, but I have got the new car. I am absolutely in love. If you don't already, Instagram has seen it first. I think this vlog's gonna go out about two or three weeks after. Um, so yeah, it's like one of them where it is currently the 1st of August today. We got it the 31st of July. Instagram seen it today. You guys might on the vlog see it like on like the 21st, maybe sometime in that week. I don't know. There's that many vlogs need doing and there's that much going on. But I really want to keep them as weekly vlogs because there is that much going on. So if I ever do have like a dull week, I'm still like miles ahead um, and stuff like that. So yeah, hope you're all well. I absolutely love my new car. Um, and I'll probably talk about it a bit more when it comes to sort of showing you and like giving you a bit of a tutorial. Because one thing I did learn from when I got the mocker and I, I made like a video on that was it i just sort of the, the i should have done better like the title and the thumbnail it should have just been more about the car and it was just like a normal vlog i remember getting a couple of comments saying like oh like i tuned in for a car video and ended up getting like your weekly shopping and stuff so i might i won't like discuss it in full and that it won't that won't be in the title like it, i will put like new car but it will be with like something else probably um, because there's a lot going on. Like I say this week, in this same vlog, you'll be getting the photos and the videographer is come the pho photographer and videographer is coming round to get photos and video of the house. Um, and yeah, we'll be going from there. So it's like there's so much going on that if you're not subscribed, definitely subscribe to mine and Katie's journey. Also, before I get in. Um, this was, so it will have happened again weeks ago by the time this comes out, but I am thinking of rebranding the channel. Um, the reason being is a lot of people probably don't know why it's called Dimmick, like uh, the might, um, but that is just like my second, that's just like my name. Um, but I am like, Katie's a massive part of this channel, so I am thinking about like getting her name into it a bit more and... You know, like we, well, Katie watches Fab and Elle a lot, and I was watching them yesterday, and then like everyone popping up, it was like, like just a, like Katie and Liam or or something like that. Like it, it was a bit more like, hmm, I don't know if Dimmick is, I don't know. I feel like there's just something, I don't know, like almost like aggressive about it. <laughs> I know it sounds weird, but anyways, enough rat waffling. So if something does change. This was when I sort of first thought about it, it was like yesterday when we were watching Fabinel. But anyways, it is August as I mentioned. Holiday is coming up, which I can't wait for. And right now, I'm about to go and get the white paint. I've got the white paint out. I'm about to go and touch up areas that need touching up. Such as the drone crash area. That needs touching up. <laughs> That was nuts. I don't know if I actually got that on film, but it was crazy. Um, then we've got behind the kitchen door where we've got paint samples. I'm actually going to wait on them ones and see what Katie wants to do because, yeah, this is how like sort of new this house all is. Is like it was still like we still haven't even decorated most rooms, and upstairs. Where there's more paint samples. These ones I'm gonna do, she gave us the green light to do these ones, purely because they are quite light anyway. Like the camera picks up that one, barely picks up that one. I'm sure that was like an off-white, so I'm gonna cover them. Um But yeah, I mean like part of us isn't stressing too much about the paint, because like as you've seen there, there's like I don't know, it's like there's almost hand prints. Or like just grub marks on there so whoever does get this house if we do move or who like if we don't sell i think like if we don't sell now i think we will get a lot more decorating done i think like in this vlog as well there's so much going on in this vlog we went to is it barker and stonehouse or i think it's barker and stonehouse so i'll go with that um and it just inspired us again so much so 
yeah, I'm going to stop waffling, get on with this painting, especially upstairs because I do want to have a bath tonight. Also, I need a haircut. Wow, that is horrific. Um, that's why I've got the cap on all the time because my hair is currently... Like, I was debating growing it out and, like, going for, like, a long, long-haired look. But I hate, it gets to this same stage all the time. And I absolutely hate it. And like, it's just messy. There's not really a lot you can do. Your hair doesn't like fully tuck behind your ears. I mean, it looks like it has there, but yeah. It, it just can't give us the ick a little bit. So I am going to go and paint. You'll see that. And then I'll catch up with you after. That is the first bit done, you can sort of see it, it is obviously really like wet still, so yeah, like I say, we were thinking of painting the full bathroom, but I just think like the time is, I think it's more because they're literally coming in, like we've got tonight and tomorrow night to sort the house, and it's like there's so much that needs doing. Um, we've got a checklist of stuff that like how it needs to be presentable. Um, the the thing that I worry about the most is the wardrobe situation because we haven't got doors on the wardrobe um, because they fell out while we were transporting it and like to be fair like me and Katie haven't we've just never really gotten round to the upstairs let alone replacing wardrobe so <sighs> yeah that's the thing that I'm sort of most sort of nervous about but if someone's buying a house, like they can, they are obviously, their, their wardrobes aren't going to be there. They'll be bringing their own, so I suppose I'm stressing over nothing really. Everyone, it is the eve of getting our house photoed and videoed, which I am slightly nervous about. I think because... It just feels like there's so much riding on, to be honest, the weather, because for me, there's no doubt this is the selling point of the house, the garden. We are about to go out. When I say we, I mean me and you. About to go out and trim it, but I am going to go around all the edges with the shears to cut because we couldn't get the strimmer to work at all. Turns out it wasn't just the wire, it was just totally knackered. So yeah, me and Katie are going to be sort of cleaning around tonight. We did a deep clean not that long ago. So it's not going to need too bad. We're just going to get the hoover back out. The mop, maybe mop the rooms. Quickly polish and clean a few bits and bobs. So we've made the decision we're not going to cook anything tonight. We're just going to go out and quickly grab something. Just to avoid extra dishes. It, to be fair, more than anything, it's time. But let's have a see how the paint looks. Oh, that looks good. Yeah, I mean, I think because we know it's there, it feels um, bad. I mean, the camera picks it up a little bit, but <laughs> I may give it one more coat because I still feel like you can see, still see some of the light blue. Hey, that looks quite nice, that. But, I am excited slash nervous. Me and Katie have potentially found a sort of backup home, if you like. Like, we've obviously got the main one that we want. But we've, we've looked again and we've found another one. Not sure how serious. I still think um, the one that you've already seen is definitely the main one. But yeah. It's all, it's just all go at the minute. It feels like there's just no time to stop and and like, it's just weird. Like we go on holiday, like we need to be thinking about that. And then we're thinking about moving house and putting this house on the market. It's just mad. But yeah, I'm going to go and get sorted. I don't know how much I'll film. I might just get like a before clip of the garden and then get an after clip because the weather is very hitty miss. But yeah, it is just, I had something else to say, but I can't remember what it was. Um, but yeah, I mean, what a vlog, to be fair. It just feels like so much has gone on. Um, so yeah, I'll pick you up. After I have trimmed the grass, hopefully, and Katie should be back cleaning round, so she might pick you up. Everyone, Katie's home. Hello. <laughs> she right didn't let me face. <laughs> we have got, oh wow, it 
That does look much better, doesn't it? Yeah, it's like an actual function. Stress levels key. Through the roof. Through the roof. Yeah, it is very stressful. The garden took a like a lot longer than it should just purely because it's so wet outside. So obviously the grass doesn't really pick up as good, but it does look a lot better than what it will. And this is what I mean, like it's actually picking up on the camera nice, whereas the things in person you can see that are quite, like make, like it looks a little bit rough around the edges basically. The camera doesn't like pick them up. And that's what I think we need to keep remembering is, we know it's not perfect. But is any house, like when I've been, like if you, when you go to view houses, um, like I mentioned before, we could be going to view another one. Oh, well, on there as well. I was thinking that as well, yeah. Just that's just from the again, blind. My nail. Oh, uh, my nail. Ring. My ring. When I've been opening and closing the blinds, it rubs against the wall. Yeah. So more. we've got the paint back out, just to sort of go go over some little marks. Like again on the camera, it's not picking up massively because it's white. I think we're actually lucky, but. Letting all the stress out, but <laughs> um, yeah. No marks. It didn't do. A, I didn't put it through a proper. It's box. yellow. It's yellow. Yeah, on the camera. <laughs> Whoa! What is with her swearing? I'm stressed. I Even suppose. Though. Wow. I suppose we'll let her off, but. Yeah, it's, it smells really nice in the bathroom. There's not too much to do because, like yeah, I say, we did bathroom. deep clean very much the other week. So I think just giving everything a sweep and a mop. It's that thing. The air freshener thing. Yeah. yeah. Just to the smell all the time. And it could also be a mix of that. And, and that, that, yeah. Because that's on. So I think just Go give on. everything a sweep and a mop. I'll just put it on. Yeah. Oh, maybe the cracks. Mm. So yeah, I'm sure Katie's gonna keep finding things for us to Sorry. touch up and stuff. But I'm yeah, kind of we're gonna get everything yeah. sorted, and I'm gonna show you each room when we're sort of done. Um, I would show you before, but I think we just want to sort of get on with it. We've just ordered some food, ordered a Mackey's, and yeah, we have got a little. I'm gonna have a little Q and A coming up um, about sort of why we're looking to move. But I am waiting for a special delivery before we do that. So yeah, I'm gonna crack on, stop talking, I'll catch us. In a second. Right, everyone, office room. Ta-da! Looking all spiff. Is it spiff and span or spick and spick? Spick. Spick and span. Just needs a good old mop. And then that will be that done. I do think like this is the one room that I'm a little bit like could put people off because it's classed as a three bedroom. I know like you obviously like and this is another thing that I keep forgetting personally Katie is like you need like people will be looking at it and going like oh well that's not obviously going to be there when if we buy it so yeah. like they're not going to get this house and all this is going to be here so I just need to keep that in mind. No that. like the furniture see it's three bed but like quite a lot of people like yeah that might be buying our house. <sighs> Sorry, just walked up the stairs. Um, are probably going to be couples like us who might yeah. not have children or might have one child. Yeah. And people, a lot of people work from home at the minute. True. Seeing it as an office might be of appeal. Shows it can be used as an office space, or like the valuer said, it would be a good single bed bedroom. Yeah. Like you still would get you get a single bed in here, and you'd still be able to fit like a fair amount in as well. Yeah. So it's like you can kind of look at it. The only thing that I thought you were gonna say was about the paint. That is it. That is the, that was but it. We looked at every room in, in the house that we like and went wallpaper. That wallpaper needs ripping off. That wallpaper needs ripping off. Yeah, exactly. If it you is. buy in a house that's not a new build where it is blank walls, the chances mm. are you're gonna to have to change something because it's not gonna be your taste yeah. on the wall, like from a wall perspective. Yeah. Or like flooring maybe even, but Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good point about the the house that we're looking at. Actually, we did. So, well, we said in the video all the wallpaper would have to be ripped off. So definitely much more early noughties style. Yeah, say. that's what I was saying today as well. Work to people, but yeah, we're gonna. 
I think we'll get this room done. Upstairs just needs we'll just need to hoover it. Um, and obviously mop the two rooms that you can mop. It's alright. Come another swear word. Oh. Um also another thing they want everything from wardrobes down and the, that's the other thing is the wardrobes because the doors ripped off and we're just like oh they'll do for now. What? What? What's up? You might want to touch up some paint in here. Yeah? White? Yeah. Oh, I'll just leave it, man. More for the viewings than... More for the viewings than, uh... Yeah. For coming, because do you remember this one? Oh, the black. Oh, the black. So I'll show them what you did. Yeah. Might need to touch that up so that it's not... Yeah, we will. The lack of the way. Like I say, maybe not for the video. No, because the, the, the door open. will probably be open covering it. But I think when people view it, you might not want that. Yeah. Good shout. Yeah, we will do that. But yeah, I'm going to pop you down because this vlog is going to be super long otherwise. So I'll catch you. I'll probably catch you when all of upstairs is done next, right? So I'll catch you in a second. Oof, right, everyone. It is 10 past 10. Is that my right, Katie? Seven minutes to be precise. Seven minutes to be precise. Upstairs is all clean. That'll be going on on the screen now. Um, I did like a little almost like walk through like what he might be doing tomorrow. Um, in the morning, Katie's going to be a legend and what are you going to do Katie? Uh, dust in here, uh, through from here. Um, mop and dust the hallway. Mop the downstairs toilet. Uh, mop in the kitchen. Yeah. Um, That's it isn't it? Yeah, and then I suppose if the weather's half decent, put the cushions on. Yeah, um, we are going to have to, I think, put them out regardless, like when he gets here. Um, but if it's raining, obviously we don't want to keep them out all morning. But look at the kitchen, man. All nice and clean. All the alcohol bottles are off the top of the fridge as well. You've got a sticker. Oh. Off, man. Off, yeah. yeah. Look at that, man. All clean. No, um, like nothing allowed pretty much in cleaning products, so everything's off there. Katie's been and brought some um, flowers to decorate. It looks really good. Got two sets there, but yeah, I mean, it's... What did you say before? Oh, she's doing an inhaler. It's like, um, she said, it's like the show home when you walk in and it's just like... Pretty much nothing, although it is a little bit better normally in the show home, but that's gonna do it for tonight. I will catch you tomorrow when I finish work. Katie might pick you up after he or she's been, or both, um, on a lunch break if she if she wants to, if she doesn't mind, just to sort of give you the lowdown straight away. Pretty much just after it's happened, that would be pretty cool. If not. We will discuss everything when I'm finished work, but I'll probably pick, well, I'll be picking these up after work anyways. So I will catch you tomorrow. Hi guys, uh, Thursday today. Um, I'm just on my lunch break, just about to get back to work actually, but um, excuse the washing machine in the back if you can hear that. Um, but I just thought I'd quickly jump on and just do a bit of a explanation as to what happened today. So the photographer came first, she did all of the photos um, and then she, when she left she said that they would be again edited tonight, going to the estate agents tomorrow so then we would then get approval before anything happened next. Uh, then the videographer came probably about five ten minutes after that um he did all of his clips and then he said the same thing he said it would probably be edited and ready with the estate agents tomorrow so once we give our approval they should be ready to go with them um, with the next steps which i believe is getting us on the market which is frightening but exciting at the same time um but yeah so that's pretty much it at the moment um Obviously Liam's still at work, um, I'm just about to get back to work, my dinner is about to end I think. Yes, I've got two minutes, so I'm going to quickly, I'm going to put you guys down, I'm going to quickly make myself a fresh cuppa for the afternoon um, and get back to it. So yeah, Liam will probably pick you guys up when he's What could this be that Liam's ordered? Hmm. 
I guess you guys will wait and see. Right, everyone. Mistakes have been made. I was in the bath, just enjoying a nice soak. Totally in a way. Sorry, let's go back. I was in the bath having a nice soak. I heard the wind, the music, the music, the rain bouncing off the window. Absolutely love it. Come downstairs. Katie's had the washing outside. So yeah, that happened. I've just left it outside until Katie comes back. She's currently doing the food shop. Oh, I was meant to have a shave. I'm gonna have to go up and do it later. Um, oh, so yeah, but today we've got a bit to go through. We had our house photoed and videoed. We've got the video back. Um, we have sent it off for approval. Um, but I'm gonna get, I'm gonna watch it through with you guys actually, and girls, and I'm gonna sort of give you mine and Katie's reaction to it, um, spoiler alert, it's amazing. Um, it's turned out so much better than we, I think we thought, but I'll, I'll go through all of that um, when we watch it through. Uh, what else happened? I forgot, but yeah. I also got a delivery. I have upgraded the camera. Um, so the reason I've sort of upgraded, one I've been wanting to upgrade for ages, I got birthday money to go towards it. So thank you for to my family for all of that. Um, but it is a bit like it is an expen it is more of an expensive camera than the G7X, but the main reason is the G7X, if you know what a one looks like, if not, maybe just give it a Google. But where the basically where the flip screen is, is it's starting to come away and it was mainly for the holiday and I was like, I don't want to go on holiday and a break when I'm away and then be stranded with like iPhone footage because I know a lot of people don't really like iPhone footage and it is also a nightmare to hold the camera and vlog with iPhone footage I find. So I wanted to get it for going away and then, but also at the minute just with everything going on like the vlogs are like non-stop. So this is like the fifth vlog or sixth vlog. I think it's the fifth vlog I've got scheduled, but we're gonna shoot like a Q and A because we've we've had so many questions about the new house, like not necessarily like questions, DMs, like everything about it, and like comments as well. Like we've had a few, so we're gonna sit down on Saturday, and so like Saturday will be the fifth of August, and that's gonna go out on the sixth. So that'll be like the most up to date everyone will be. But I need to plan ahead because so much has happened that you guys won't have seen. So it's like it's a tough one because when you're watching this, it, I mean, when's this vlog? This so we've got so vlog two's just gone out. Vlog three was the Q and A potentially, or like video three. Vlog four. There's so much that you haven't seen. Well, you will have seen when this goes out. So, vlog, like, this is what's planned already. So, we've got, so we've had, so we've seen a new house, which was us coming, like, coming back. Viewing our potential forever home, which has gone live just now, as, like, I'm recording this. Vlog 3, rebrand Q&A and explain why we're looking to move. Um, vlog I know it's confusing, but that's not really a vlog, that's a Q&A. Vlog 3 is getting our home valued, which again, you'll already seen. Vlog 4, birthday getaway for Luke's birthday. Vlog 5, house photos, videographer, and the new car. So this is going to be vlog 5. <laughs> so it's like, there's so much going on. And bear in mind, vlog 5 is due to go out on the 17th of August. We go on holiday on the 23rd of August. So that's when like the holiday vlogs would start. Like they were sort of next week or something but yeah we've got so much planned there's so much going on so i wanted a camera to make sure that i could capture all of it gonna stop waffling now the next time pick us up will be with katie and the food right everyone so we are about to react to the drone slash well the video, video footage from like the, the visit through. today we have got it emailed back to us we have just have we just approved it Yes. Yes, we've just approved it for use. We're now just waiting on the photos to be edited and sent back to us to approve them also. Oh wow, I'm Sorry. really entertaining Katie today. 
Um, I just want to quickly say before we put it on the screen, I wish I caught this because Katie didn't watch it until I got back from work at half four. Um, so I really wish that I'd caught it when we first watched yeah. it because Katie <clears throat> did get upset. Um, it's not like a bad upset, is it? It's like a, no, it's just it's emotional. Just emotional. It's uh, like when you see it as well. Tone. You said as well the music was yeah. like really. I don't know why the music just triggered set me you, off. didn't it? Yeah. So it's we're so hoping cool. that the photos can get sent back, and then in the next vlog, it will be. Hopefully our home is up for sale. More than likely. Which, which is, is crazy, isn't it? Mad. It's like, yeah. But anyways, let's get into it in three, two, one. <coughs> Kitchen's still my favorite thing. Yeah, definitely. I think because it leads out into the garden as well, it's always so bright and then wow. We were so lucky that the sun actually came out because it's been miserable the last few days, mm -hmm. hasn't it? So glad I did the grass as well. I love that shot. I know, that's good, isn't that good? That's like a good like shot as well, well, isn't it? And all but to be fair, it doesn't look as bad as what I thought it was gonna look either. Also the paint blends in quite nicely in the bathroom. Oh, I just realised he moved the um scallows. Oh did he? Mm -hmm. oh, the drone footage <coughs> that he gets as well is really good. Like I do want to learn to do something like that. Oh I didn't realise it did that after as after yeah. sale. So yeah, that is that. Um, you all right? Yeah. Bit emotional again. Uh, no, no, not, <laughs> no. I just, it's just mental, isn't it? Yeah, I think like we, we, I think we were planning on doing a Q and A um, <clears throat> on Saturday, maybe to go out on the Sunday, but obviously. I don't want to give, I don't want to explain too much because the vlogs are quite far behind. So it's going to be hard to maybe question things. Um, but the questions should be within, like, we just need to, like, I don't know how to word this. We just need to structure our answers so we don't give too much away for coming vlogs. Yeah. Otherwise, that's when we're in trouble. But yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this video. Um, and when I say in trouble, that's when like we just give too much <coughs> away, basically. Then, um, you got any closing thoughts, Katie? Mm, no. no, not really. She gave it all before, to be fair. But I hope you've enjoyed. Let us know in the <coughs> comments down below. Um, also subscribe. Like this journey, it could end next week. It could end with us getting a new house. So, and also even if we don't get a new house, like we are planning after the holiday a lot in this house anyways. Like there is a lot still to do, isn't there? Like that we want to do that could add more value to the house, etc. And yeah. just make the house if we don't get a home, sale, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Especially if we don't yeah, if we don't get a sale, there's no guarantee. Um and I hope it doesn't come across like that that we think we're just gonna get the house sold because I know that I definitely don't think we'll mm. like it's a guarantee. <laughs> because of the current state of the market and stuff. But yeah, hope you've enjoyed, like the video, subscribe, and we'll catch you in the next one. <laughs>